Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Prospero. Hey guys. <laughs> Compliments of the season. Merry Xmas and a Happy New Year in advance. Uh, and today I'm going to be telling you guys how it was like the first day, first week in Russia, how it was like my experience. Ah, but first I'm feeling my cap. I didn't put on black. I didn't, sorry, I didn't put on red. I chose black today. And not red as usual. I think I'm feeling myself. Hey, the feeling the nigga. The nigga feeling. I Hey. It's before YouTube you even stand up license, whatever. It is to do. Um first day in Russia was let's start by that. Okay, I I my flight wasn't a direct flight, it was a connecting flight from the, uh, my current Lagos to Dubai and from Dubai to Moscow. Then from Dubai to Moscow, there was no black actually. Okay, there was this one man. He's from South Africa. My I was lucky when he saw me, he was like friendly with me, chatting, I wasn't like feeling lonely. Blah 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 blah. Then before I came down to the came down from right when the when I was like, I think got to Moscow. If I got down, he told me, um, I'm sorry, I'm not going, I'm not actually stopping in Moscow, I'm going to another country. I have a connection flight. So better put on your jacket, it's cold out there. <laughs> I thought he was joking. And before that, I was wearing a gown, I wasn't even wearing trousers. I was warned, I was told that this place is actually very cold. But I still behave like I don't care. I'm still doing Nigerian Shakara. I was wearing my gown, my pencil, my outfit. You know, I just respected whatever and put on my jacket. <laughs> As I was just walking down from the plane, you know, when you open <laughs> open a freezer, that chill, that um feeling that you get, like the chill, how, like the vapor. That same feeling, it just exactly the same feeling, like a freezer. I, I haven't gotten into the main freezer. I would just like, I just opened it. I would just up there. I was like, hey, hey. <laughs> now I know that this, what people are saying are act, is actually true. I just got down. Like I was feeling so cold. I got to the cab that was to pick me up. But before then, we spent time somewhere outside, and because we're making a call, I was actually stranded making a call to someone they could speak they will speak to because I don't understand Russian then. So the person that like that was to pick me up in my town they called him he could speak English and he's a he's Russian actually. They communicated with so he gave them direction on how to help me and bring me blah, blah, blah. but then as we were still talking on phone <laughs> it's like the the man didn't notice that I was wearing just gown. Nothing was covering my legs. Oh my gosh! I already told God, please forgive me my sins. And you have, I told I'm going to die. You God, for you have sinned against you in the past. Even now, if I'm sinning against you, have mercy upon me, and I'm going to die. Just forgive me all my sins, so that I'll make heaven if I die. Like give a video. If I was filmed that day, the first day I came here, <laughs> be all about crack, crack your ribs, something like very funny. <laughs> I thought I was going to die. I already wrote to my mom. <laughs> and about the style of the people, the character, actually, this place is friendly. It's not as, um, uh, <laughs> let me not give them so much credit. Like, 
I do everything about this business friendly. Uh, the first time though, they're friendly actually, just try to ignore, like I'm talking, I'm giving advice to first year student, like the first timers here, what you're to expect. Their friend, they actually don't want to take pictures with you, they like your hair, and especially um, the English, because they know we blacks, we speak English. Like they think all of us speak English. So they want to, oh, please teach me. But just know their friend, they are not so hard as. <laughs> and if you're lost, don't, don't fear to ask. You might, if you're working, you might see people on the way. Um, they might be bone in their face, like they don't care. But just approach, if you approach one of them, they're going to give you the best smile in the world. Like just this place. People working on the bone in their face, like you won't be scared to act. But just approach one, you see smile. Oh my God. So hard touching smile. Smile that can change your day. Eh? They're friendly, you forget, but don't vex them. You vex them, you see the devil heartless part of them. Finally, the first day I got here, everyone wants to take a picture of me and they like my hair. I was on this red braid, burgundy colored braid. It's my best color. So, everyone wanted to take a picture. Or like, oh, I even made a friend like the next day or after two days. A friend too, because she wanted to learn English. From there, we became friends and all that. People are friendly. The first Russian friend I yes, meet, okay. her name is Anastasia. Mm -hmm. She's actually so friendly. She's so interested in um African culture. She actually made our break here. Helped her. Other one, Anastasia is a dancer. Like not just Russian dancer, but African dancer. You can imagine a Russian dancer, Igbo dance even more than me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this place is actually friendly. It's not like. Cold, like I don't mean cold, cold. It's cold weather. I'm talking about the people's behavior. Although you meet um along the way, you meet some arrogant, uneducated asses, but just ignore them. Make them make them feel like though they don't exist. Yeah, it's allowed. Okay. So new students, you have to speak the code, get prepared. The code is so, I mean, it's extreme. Sort of, I so cold, very, very, very cold itself can be used to compare. It's so cold. I even have allergies. I have allergies to cold, my complex. I think my eyes is getting better. It was red before. I'm getting better. So this is going to be the end of the video. See you next time in the next video. Meow. Yeah.